You already know what it is, man. Salute to the subscribers, that notification game, etc., etc. Don't let them get too far ahead of you. You know who I be. Got my guy with me. Showtime SP to nobody that knows bodies. Bow. Yeah, yeah. And you know what we do here, so we'll continue to say Happy New Year. I hope everything is going well with y'all, your plans, and all the stuff that you got going on. Bring SP through, you know what I'm saying? Salute to you. Happy New Year to you and yours, you know what I'm saying? Um, it's a lot going on out here, you know what I'm saying? Like, And I think... A lot of people reacted, like earlier in the week we did a vlog and uh, it was like, you know, we talked about a bunch of different subjects mm -hmm. and we recapped and some people are starting to like that style. So we'll recap a couple battles in here. We'll talk about relevant topics, you okay. know what I'm saying? And just make it uh, make it what it is, what it is, man. So yesterday, you know, uh, the algorithm was algorithming yeah. for Cat Williams, man. Did you get to watch the interview? Of course I did. I watched all two hours and forty five minutes and forty six seconds of it. I sure did. The floor is yours. You I, got, sure I need did. I need a couple minutes. Tell me what's up. All right. Man. Let me tell you, all right. So let me tell what's you what's up, man. What what the real problem is? Oh, I'm a man. big I'm a big stand up comedy fan. I like to call myself a stand up connoisseur. Like you know I do you, have you, favorites. You are definitely yeah yeah. I love stand up comedy when it comes to these specials and stuff like that. I usually watch it by the way. Check out that Dave Chappelle joint, the Dreamer that joint just dropping. That was good too. But Cat Williams, so I see on Twitter, and that'd be a horrible place to go to when you want that your news information. Not a good news source. They clip up the wrong shit. And then they want to tell you this is what it is. So what they right. did was they clipped up a lot of Cat Williams rants about other um, comedians, about what happened between them two. And he basically was saying who's trash and who's not trash and and, 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 and some other things, like who paid the price and stuff like that. Yeah, yeah. So I wanted to actually take a look at the whole thing. So shout out to Club Shan uh, uh, to Club Shay Shay because Shannon has been interviewing stand up comedians, mm -hmm. and so therefore Ricky Smiley, uh, Steve Harvey, Cedric, Cedric the Entertainer, mm -hmm. a lot of these guys have already been on uh, Shannon uh, Shannon's platform, and they've given their side of the story. I can right. honestly say, as wild as these as these statements are that Cat is saying, he's only given his account of the story too. Uh, a lot of the things that he is saying in in this in this interview is from his standpoint, how yep. he feels about it. Now, granted, you know we can't speak. He speak. He speak like that auntie that done had that third glass of Taylor Port, yeah. and now she want to tell everybody what the problem is. Cat pulled up to the table like the dark skinned dude, and why did I get married? And he yelled out Yahtzee. That's what happened with Cat. He let the smoke go. Mm -hmm. How I feel about it. It's inaccurate. I, some things is just a little bit inaccurate. The timelines and the phrases and who stole what. It's a little inaccurate, but I ain't gonna fault the man for saying how he feels and how he stayed. It was wild though. Long three hours. How you feeling? Uh, well, nah, nah, nah. There was some things that he's been saying that's kind of been checking out, which is crazy. Like what? Like when he talked about uh, he wouldn't let himself be with another man for money. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Uh, Gary Owen came out yesterday and he spoke about that, saying that you know he felt like he was about to be for you know, some indecent proposal type mm -hmm. to mm -hmm. be in the industry. Yeah, he that's spoke one about story. That. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Then he spoke about it was a lot of different things. So he spoke about uh, the, the 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 men in the dresses in these movies. Mm -hmm. That's been panning out. Brandon T. Jackson basically said his career was never the same after he wore a dress. You right. Know what I'm he was like that. It, it, certain roles in Hollywood, and I seen um, the legend Don D.C. Curry, mm -hmm. he was talking earlier saying that they were trying to get him to be in a dress, mm -hmm. and then the people who turned down some of these roles didn't get other roles, you know what I'm saying? And I don't know if this is a thing to like emasculate men and things like that, but it looks crazy, but I will say this, mm -hmm. there's a lot of things Cat Williams said that were inaccurate, like saying that he could read a whole book at three years old, like really I have a three year old and they ain't reading no whole damn book, you know what I'm saying? That's number one. Number two, saying he can still run like a 4-1 at 40 years old. Dog, you run faster than than uh You told than, Shannon? Than, than Tyree Hill. You told like, Shannon? He said that with no conscience. Like he runs faster than Tyree Hill right now. He is short though, so and I do believe he could get the four. Right. But no, but no. uh there was like I said, he he definitely was there to refute a lot of shit, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Because the Cedric the Entertainer, I fully believe it. Like when I seen, cause I've seen like a bunch of different jokes that people are like insinuating that Cedric the Entertainer took. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Whether it be the spaceship joint, mm -hmm. then he had the other one where he was talking about, uh, you can call me my initial. Yeah, by you know my initials. Mm -hmm. That's by another initials. one. Mm -hmm. And then he said, well, you know what? I'm glad that you feel that way, cause he done stole your shit too. And they see the dudes in there pop locking mm -hmm. when he was doing the pop locking. That was from another. It's a lot. It's just a lot of lot of different allegations. You know what I'm saying? And mm -hmm. the thing is, when Cedric the Entertainer talks about it. Mm -hmm. He's not really giving no. Like, he's like, oh, I was talking about. I ain't do that. That's my mm -hmm. joke. 
It's a long interview. It's definitely a lot to it, man. But uh, we'll talk about that later. later. I was about to say, the only thing I will say about stealing jokes, uh -huh. it is a very thin line the same way how the correlation is. Well, what this got to do with battle rap? It's funny you said that. There's a lot of correlations to stand-up comedy that it is to battle rap. Mm -hmm. What subjects can be talked about, what subjects can't be talked about, right? Mm -hmm. When it comes to stealing or ghostwriting, mm -hmm. These are things that are dancing around it. Now, from what I'm understanding, yeah, just because this person, uh, yes, a comedian can hear that joke and and maybe take that joke and try to revamp it and make it something like it's Repacking his, that does happen often. But to the people that make that joke, they are the ones that should stand up and say, hey, that's my joke. And so that's why Cat Williams is saying... Right. That nigga stole my joke. I remember they, there was a big thing with Carlos Mencia and Joe Rogan. This is now we're going all types of stand-up comedy. Mm -hmm. But there was an issue where Carlos Mencia was, was known for stealing people's jokes. Mm -hmm. Then there was one, I saw a documentary called Dark Side of Comedy. And in that segment, they showed that Carlos Mencia stole Bill Cosby's whole thing mm -hmm. bar for bar. Mm -hmm. The only thing I can say about the Cat Williams and the Cedric the Entertainment thing is what Cat Williams is saying is the only thing he did is he took my shit and put it in a spaceship. That is true, but the premises are two different things. So you can repackage it and try to make it his. Cat's right, Sands right. What's next? Oh, uh, man. Uh, <laughs> uh, uh, listen, it's, it's so much. The virgin, the virgin butthole thing. Oh, that was crazy. Yeah, yeah that was crazy. Um, so shout out to, the, you know what I'm saying, that interview and everything that went with it. But mm -hmm. moving on to Battle Rap, man. There's a couple battles that came out this week. We'll talk about both. Mm -hmm. uh, well, one came out last week. And you know, Twerk, I had seen him, I, and this is the one thing I will say. We can start with their battle, and then we'll get to uh, the Mac Myron and Tay Rock versus uh, mm -hmm. Clean. <laughs> Mac Myron and Clean versus Tay Rock and Swervo. We'll talk about that towards the end. Okay. But I want to start with the New Jersey Twerk battle. Uh, okay. I will say this, right? So shout out to him and everything that he's got going on. I can tell that he's locked in as far as his career goes and mm -hmm. what he has going on and trying to be better at what he does. Cause this is the first time I heard, I done seen her and knew about this nigga since easily 2017, mm -hmm. right? 18, 19, 20, 20 Twerk or 22, 23, EK. 24, twerk, right? Yeah, 27 years mm -hmm. I've known about this nigga mm -hmm. from when I met him. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Never in his career has he really been adamant. Like, he hit me up to recap the battle. Now, you know, I told him I was going to Michigan, and I went to Michigan, then I had a death in the family mm. and things like that. So it's been, you know, we, we've spoke about this battle, and I liked it, you know what I'm saying? But we didn't get to recap it, you know what I'm saying? Okay. So I said, uh, I was like, duh, yeah, he hit me up. He asked me about it. I was like, yeah, we're going to do it. With the and I seen him tweet about it yesterday. Again, I sent you the tweet, and I was mm -hmm. like, yo, this nigga really, like, is, is he wants, to do he wants people to talk about it. Now, okay. he, didn't, he wasn't tweeting us, but I seen what he yeah. said, and I took to it because I said I was going to do something, so I'm doing it. Mm -hmm. um, last second, see, uh, you know, obviously a platform EK has put together. He's got a lot of dope battles on his platform. He battled Rum Nitty on there, Jazz Battle Twerk on there. The Jazz vs. Twerk wasn't really a great, I didn't really feel like it was a great battle to me. It was okay it was to okay. me. Yeah. Uh, when you, like, I've seen other people talk about it. When you shoot promo with your opponent, it's just like yeah. me and you sitting together like like a boxing I'm match and we turn yeah. to each other. Like, <laughs> like that's the like, you know what I'm saying? I, 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 I can understand It's a little too fresh, you know what I'm saying? saying? But um, he battles EK on there and mm -hmm. some of the material, like he was really wild in that battle, man. And I want to give him props and admiration for it and to EK, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Because of the whole platform in general. Whenever they put out a battle, we usually watch it. We've talked about a lot of them. We've recapped a lot of them. Yes, we have. And the platform is gaining traction. And mm -hmm. I hope to see them continue to succeed in 2023. Matter of fact, what the fuck? Where's my phone call? You niggas, niggas like me now. Well, you know what I'm saying? Mean, Where's my call? Like, I mean, right now, his last battle was in a box. I don't think I want to be in a box. That's I just me personally. I don't want to be in a box. Well, where's the, but, but what's up? You know what I'm saying? Gray area. You know what I'm saying? You need some newscasters for gray but, uh, area. You know what I'm saying? But, 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 uh, back to it, man. What you thought about the battle? Shout out to EK, man. You know what I'm saying? And it's, all, it's always love and respect for Twerk. You know what I'm saying? We've been giving him his flowers. You know, he was number two on our list. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? But shout out to EK because the thing that he has been doing is called the Crashing Out series. And that's where he's battled um, legends and certified killers. That's where the Rum Nitties and the Geechee Gotties and the, uh, and the, um, he battled J Mills. He battled Marv One. Um, I believe, uh, I don't think A-War was in that list, but there, he's mm -hmm. done a, a list of names before mm -hmm. he retires. Or he's done with battle rapping and he wants to do straight filmmaking and stuff like right, that. Right, so right, that's right, respecting right. him for that. But you know the crazy thing is that make me mad about battles like this? Is like you kind of make me now want to put the microscope on all of your words and everything. 
I really put the microscope on this battle. I just want to know, Vada, can I go in the way I want to go in? Listen, listen to what we do here, man. <laughs> listen to what we, listen. First of all, it's only a few here that do here mm -hmm. what we do here, That's and actually. it's a new year. Mm -hmm. So let's be too clear mm -hmm. that you're going to get to do what you do here mm -hmm. and make it new clear. You know what I'm saying? Listen. Let it stew. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know, we're going to take it through the rounds. Allow me to break it down. Round one on New Jersey twerk. Mm -hmm. Um... This was not us, but it was a shot, and it just it just felt right, but I felt it. At the same time, he says, if y'all don't pay me what you told me at the end, he said, me and the homies pulling up the Fox Studios, mm. jumping out the Fords with heat of scorching. Mm -hmm. Let Fox try to steal from me. I'm open up door of the Explorer. Open up doors of the Explorer, door of the Explorer. Let Fox try to steal from me. Swiper, no swiping. Next no, no, thing. No, no, no. I ain't like that. I'm going to be honest. I didn't <laughs> like that shit. You know I, mean? I, I didn't like that you shit. You ain't like that? I thought shit was fucking trash. Nigga, who you pulling up on? Who the fuck <laughs> you pulling up on? Who the fuck you pulling up on? It's son? not us. Who the fuck was it? Oh. Fox 5. Oh, my bad. Fox right, 5. That's my dog, dude. That shit was fire. Who the fuck you? I feel you. That's cool. That's cool. We good, execs. We good. We good. <laughs> <laughs> nah, that shit was fine. I heard that show. I was like, yeah. He's on TV. He's talking He's about me. TV. Talk about me. Talk he about says, you. um, uh, you think you're going to continue your show without my prices? Mm -hmm. If I see one gray area, I'm buying a chopper. It's, Midlife mm, crisis? That shit was crazy. If I see one gray area. All right. the gray in the area. Mm -hmm. and you I'm buying buy a chopper. Oh, buying a chopper. Wow. Like a midlife for It's fine. We're going to keep cooking. Yeah. Yeah, all right, all right, oh, it's going to be a couple of those. Right, oh, it's going to be a couple of those. Yeah, all right, my nigga. Yeah. Ahead, man. Smith & Wesson, American Steel, like Christopher Columbus. Mm -hmm. American Steel. Because the Americans stole. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah Christopher Columbus. He, yeah, he stole America. Anyway, he said, um, your name is Saad Soule. What, a, what that EK shit all about? Mm -hmm. Blade on me. I can show what this gym star about. Oh, yeah. Poke a hole on the side. Look like I'm trying to get the SIM card out. Because <laughs> we got to get the SIM card. Well, you know, the new ones, they ain't got the yeah. SIM card trade. Yeah. But I know that, yeah, the new phone, they ain't got the SIM card mm -hmm. trade. It's the eSIM. But I'm, I'm, I'm with you. Yeah. I'm with you. you know what I'm saying the SIM mm -hmm. card trade for the service. I got you. Mm -hmm. He says, I'm thinking about shaking. Oh, he said he was going to torture. Uh, he say he gonna torture his girl. Um, mm -hmm. he gonna make Sarah. Uh, he gonna torture Sarah, right? But how he gonna t torture her? He says, "I'm thinking shaking up a hive nest mm -hmm. and doing the whore just wrong. Mm -hmm. Yellow jackets on a little white bitch look like the logo on Morton Salt. Wow. You ever seen the Morton yeah. Salt? The little girl with the raincoat. Come. On. Wow. It's fine. It, it, it's it's okay. Yeah, it's yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah. That that one don't Some make. Some may you... not have seen. Hold on, pull. I gotta pull. Then you gotta pull up the logo. Here it is. <laughs> Yellow jackets on a little white bitch look like the logo of Morton. So oh man. Oh man. I just leave pause for the cause, man. That's crazy. You know what else I like? What? I'm gonna tell you what else I like. He says when. What? He says. He says uh, when I kill E K. Right. He says when I kill E K. Mm -hmm. When the next time we go on CRE mm -hmm. is when they, they take it out of the creek. Out of oh, out of a creek? Oh, crazy. Spell creek? Okay. Hold on. When we go to CRE? Quiet, mm -hmm. when we take it off. We take we EK, EK out of the creek. C R that now now that was crazier because it was C R E, but it's C R. Mm -hmm. Alright, go mm -hmm. ahead. Man. I'm good. I ain't mm -hmm. doing this today. Uh and then he ends the round. He said it'll be a long rail. He said it'll be a long red trail. Like Google Maps and mm -hmm. traffic, yeah, cause you know when you in, in, when you on Google Maps and it's, it's tell you it's, it's traffic ahead is gonna be red all mm -hmm. the way down. Like, all right, cool. This is my problem with Ek. He can really write. I understand that he got that type of flow mm -hmm. that gotta let you know, but you gotta hear every single thing or you really wouldn't know. Mm -hmm. He says the madness that gave. He said that madness to me gave it a facade, cause where I'm from, if you clap someone in a coma, you didn't you finish, finish the job. job. That was fire out the gate too. Watch it. He says they acting tough. I head to Africa, passports and prints. Mm -hmm. I bring it back for proof or history that our black father's rich. Mm -hmm. I tell the kids Ghana is real. Siri packed all with sense. They think I'm pro hybrid when I tell them Madagascar exists. Madagascar, oh man. Pro hybrid. I'm Madagascar exists. Mm -hmm. Hold on. He says I go to Africa. Right? I go to Africa. I tell the kids Ghana is real. Mm -hmm. Siri. Syria. So my bad. Every time I keep saying Siri, she pop up. She says, packed all with sense. Syria is known for the, all of the... Never mind. It's fine. Mm -hmm. He said he'd rather stay with the stainless and claiming how he bang it, though. Mm -hmm. And I think you too good to have to twerk. 
<laughs> I sound like <laughs> a Captain Saber Ho. Fire. Uh, you'll need Affleck trying to drill our turnus to Armageddon. See, in the movie Armageddon, mm -hmm. Ben Affleck was in the movie. He was a dr It's fine. Mm -hmm. He says, all the skills, pay my bills, I'm really stuck in a rut. Living dreams over magazines I cover every month. Because mm -hmm. he's talking about the bills. Mm -hmm. And living his dreams, Good that means cover. he doesn't have a nine to five, right? So mm -hmm. over the magazines I still cover every month. <laughs> It's it, it, it's fine. Round one. Oh, spoiler alert! Twerk tells you what happens in the battle in the very first couple seconds of the battle. Mm -hmm. He says the first round I might give it to me. Second round was the craziest round, and the third he gonna get an EK. That's the spoiler alert. I kind of agree with it. We can debate that first round, but for safekeepings, I'll say I'll say edge to Twerk in the first round. Mm -hmm. I'll, I'll slightly edge to Twerk in the first round. Round two on Twerk, it comes back. He says. When it come to completing the mission, same nigga went to court, told, he said, uh, uh, same nigga went to court and told what he seen from a distance. He'll retract his whole statement once his seeds get a visit. Mm -hmm. And them kids will get a sucker to forget all about the shots. I'm a pediatrician. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The kids will get a sucker and forget all about them shots. Mm -hmm. I'm a... This rifle barely ever leaves my hand. You try to dip off, scopes on 4,007 meters in. Could, he said, I could do you like the real Kennedy. Make him wish he never even ran. Ooh. Emerson Kennedy. Ooh. Wish he never even ran. That was crazy because he's saying if he ran, he hit him from a distance. He hit him from the, but then again, Kennedy got shot from it. It's fine. Make him never, it's okay. He says. And he's saying, make sure, he's saying wish he never ran. Mm -hmm. Ran for president mm -hmm. to even be in that predicament. Fire. He says, I'm from a block. Well, we don't even know what we beefing for. Mm -hmm. Still a nigga's son might die. Mm -hmm. Still this nigga hun might die. Mm -hmm. You ask me, I say, hey, E, I owe you. I can't even tell you sometimes why. why? What? Now, come on, man. What the fuck, what are we doing here? Why am I still here? I, I don't even know why he want me to recap this shit. Why do you want me to recap this shit? Like, this is crazy. What the fuck we doing? Even, even, even niggas is catching strays. He says, one of your homies try to jump in? Bad move. I knock a side nigga out. Pat Poos. Okay, now, the shot was to Pat Poos, but what is Emerson Kennedy's real name? Oh, okay, all right. And he says, if his homie jumping, that's a side stick. Why does it work? Why does it work? Okay, hold on. Red rag around the turtleneck look like Franklin. Did you see the cartoon Franklin? It was With a little king and a little red rag yeah. tied around his neck. It's cool. When it comes to funerals, I done lost about 30 to the street. It's the GameCube intro. I done seen see that box go around, around so many times and turn into turn into a G. G. <laughs> He's on fire. Oh my God. Hit you. Get your mans, it's coming, and I'm going to try to do it the right way. I swear I'm going to try to do it the right Boom, way. Boom, shotgun. I'm going to try to do it the right way. He says, you got to earn this in the streets. Then you got to be receiving mad blessings. EK, you call your shit last second C, but you better make every second last C, or they going to be peeping you half-stepping. I done seen a nigga come up second to last, seen a nigga come up first and be eager to blast at him. See, that thought could last a second C, and then that could just creep up and blast at at him. Now you seeing his seconds last cause you ain't see to the last second. Hey yo, get your mans. Why are we doing time limits here? Hold on. He said, see, last second see, see to your last second. You get killed in your last seconds, but now your man is shot. So now you only see in his last seconds only cause you didn't see him in the last second. Crazy, crazy, crazy shit, crazy. Whoa! I'm gonna chill. All right, um, uh, the old Disney movie pull up and Fox, uh, pull up on Fox and hound you. You really laying heavy yeah, on this Fox. I, I, don't, I, I don't like this why I ain't this. This why you ain't want to This why right here I ain't even kidding no more. I'm telling the truth. I did recap it because I said now I'm, 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 my first reason was the reason. He said listen, but this is no. no. He said but I'm just too many shots. The Fox is too close. Yeah. It's an affiliate. Same thing. Um, he says um. If I kill EK, you gotta put me in a in, in a cell, right? And if he don't die, and y'all put us in the same cell, you better hope to God they better lock me somewhere not even bail exists, holding cell far away from you like a selfie stick. That's crazy. Cause it, cause it's the so self. Far it's away. far away from. Crazy, it's okay. Crazy. It's all right. He can't even hear his organ like Beethoven. Mm. You see, because Beethoven was deaf, and that means when he was playing, he couldn't hear his. Okay, it's fine. Mm. All right. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Fire. Fire second round from New Jersey twerk. The question is, can EK beat it? I'm going to tell you this. 
Your boy swung as hard as he could. All right, so listen, he said, it's truly a misconception. Twerk won't pull in this direction. It's always the nose ring niggas that be fools with big aggression. Till the ring becomes a target and the fool get hit with Wessons. Try and attack, I'll throw like Dak. Every bullet in a septum. So because mm -hmm. uh, we understand that Dak Prescott is a terrible is a terrible quarterback. I'm just playing. I just don't like the Cowboys. My bad. But Dak Prescott yeah, throws yeah, interceptions, right? That, yeah. Interceptions, right? Interceptions. Yeah. But did you know what this part of your nose is called yeah, and why yeah, they put yeah. the nose ring in it? It's called the septum, isn't it? Yeah. Why are you why are you just going back to directed movies? I kinda need you to keep rapping for a minute, EK. I kinda like this flow. I'm used to it now. I don't know where my parents come from. When you was in that crash, you had you uh you was me uh, mentally damaged. That con uh that uh where your conscience was kind of numb from. They had to tell you you were in an accident. My father said I was one. Mm. You uh uh it was a first world problem like a split Pangea. It's a first world problem mm. like a split Pangea because when the world was all together at one point in time and then earthquakes and stuff like that. He says um uh I don't like how bro be moving. All that bouncing for a result can get you jumped on conclusion. Mm. All that bouncing can get you jumped to conclusion. It's all right. He says, home of DeMar DeRozan. It's where Lakers over Golden. Got me betting on Anthony Davis. Always hoping he ain't broken. Mm. What that mean? I'm just used to niggas that can snap at any moment. E.K. Can you get fine. your mates? I bet on I bet on AD before. I, I remember because I was the LeBron game and LeBron AD, AD, AD they was playing great and I had to put money on it. That was the last time I ever put money on school. Right. Um, fuck a shooter. I'm cruising Cuba. Sound like the cast of Jerry Maguire. I'm cruising Cuba. Cast, cast the sound of, mm. of Jerry Maguire. It's cool. I used to eat off paper plates until I put them on a the bins. Mmm. Paper plates on the bins. Put the temporary tag on the bin. Fire. It's all right. <laughs> now, round three, uh, it's a rough shot. I'm going to say that because I really enjoyed that second round from both sides. I think it does de uh, depend on how it goes. But I did get a couple shots from uh, Twerk uh, uh, where he said uh, 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 he called um, EK a nerd. Um, and he basically got bullied in high school. They poured his lunch on him. They poured chicken noodle soup and a soda on a side. Mm. That was right. hot. Mm -hmm. uh, you probably know all the words to NSYNC. Uh, you are Uncle Tom, like Gronkowski kids. Cause their uncles, Tom Brady, cause Ron Kowski's kids, Tom Brady would be their uncle. Mm -hmm. That's magic. He talked about, uh, you know how EK got a white girlfriend. He got jungle fever. Uh, he he got jungle fever like ma my, like malaria. Mm, uh, uh, he said, if I'm, uh, he says, if I, uh, if I uh, bang your girlfriend, you're gonna want to kill yourself. The way I made ceremony, you're gonna be planning your own funeral service. That's a good one too. And he said, I got a tweet from KD. He says, um, yeah, he said, uh, I got a tweet from KD. He didn't know that I was a fan of him, but Propella, turns out, he's a fan. He's a huge fan. Because oh, Propella, turns out, mm -hmm. it's okay. <laughs> uh, EK, um, he did the rebuttal for the NSYNC joint where he said, who's going to kill him? It's going to be me. That was low-hanging fruit, but I still like that. Speaking of low-hanging fruit, he says, you are a strange fruit. Ain't that code for leaving niggas hanging? Strange fruit hanging from the pop. Mm -hmm. Come on now. He says, um, I'd rather, instead of buying Cupid Links, I'd rather go talk to Fidel Castro. That was hot. Um, the moonlight in La La Land. La La Land is L.A. Um, he said, uh, uh, that's the land you confuse denominations. Because he was talking about how many different things he does there. And the way he ended it off is the braggadocious way. He said, I got my mama a part of the, he said, I bought my mom a wing of the new house. He said, it's crazy because she wanted me to go to Morehouse. And now she actually lives in it. Mm. More house, because more, more, I more, got more the, house. the wing built. It's fine. Mm -hmm. I don't care who really wins this battle. I can say New Jersey twerk probably first in the second. Mm -hmm. Ooh, but it can't, y'all. New Jersey twerk, 2-1, first and second. But I'm not mad if y'all say that EK got the second and the third, because the second is a lot closer than I say. How you call it? Uh, I got twerk 2-1. You know what I'm saying? And Phenomenal battle, though. You know what I'm saying? Phenomenal battle. I think he did good. Um, you know what I'm saying? I think that uh, when you think of EK, you know what I'm saying, um, you got to look at it from the perspective of the MCs that he's battling, the effort that they're putting in, and you know what I'm saying, the, the quality of the battle. And I feel like all three of these were, you know, they, they hit on all spectrums. Mm -hmm. uh, lyrics is good. I see why uh, Twerk would want people to talk about it and see the lyrical spar in this battle. You yeah. know what I'm saying? So I, yeah. I rock with that. But, um, you know, it is what it is. Uh, moving on. Mm -hmm. 
Mac Myron versus Mac Myron and Clean Paper mm -hmm. versus mm -hmm. versus Swervo and Tay Rock. What's up with it, man? Let me take these off, man. Let me just make get, let me gauge these thoughts and take these off. Let me cool down. You go ahead and break it on down. How you feel about it? Uh, so so I watched it on the app. You know what I'm saying? About an hour or so ago, mm. and to see you know Tay Rock still you know he's taking a lot of battles. He's been battling newer people. Mm -hmm. Now he's giving a newer guy opportunity. This is not the first time he did it. He battled he he, battled he's a black him. captain. <laughs> with, he battled him mm -hmm. and then jumped a two on two with him. Mm -hmm. He had a two on two with Easy the Black Captain. Mm -hmm. He's done a two on two with uh with Chess. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like he's done a lot of these joints where he'll take mm -hmm. somebody who's not like way, way, way up there with him mm -hmm. and bring him up there and give him the experience and the exposure. Mm -hmm. They battled against Clean Paper and Mac Myron. Obviously, Mac Myron is a guy who's been battling for a minute, you know what I'm saying? Do I don't really feel like he's made it to the plateaus and platforms that he wants to be yet. He was on RBE for a minute. He left RBE. He was, he was battling a bunch of places, yeah. you know what I'm saying? And he went to URL. He's been on URL for a couple years now, actually. He battled Ryder a couple years ago. Yep. He's had some other battles. He battled Fonz. I don't think the Fonz battle really went the way he wanted it to go. Right. But some of the battles, see, the thing is, I fuck with Mac Myron. Mm. But, Mac, man, you know what I'm mm -hmm. saying? He's a good MC, mm -hmm. a great puncher. He uses a lot of comedy, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying, in his jokes and shit sometimes. And he has a lot of jokes and snaps in his bars, mm -hmm. and sometimes it might not transition the best with URL crowds. Right. Then he's coming from RBE, and you know the stigma of the RBE URL, so URL has their own. So he's fighting a lot of different things while battling against good MCs. Mm -hmm. Then you say clean, clean is clean, you know what I'm saying? I don't have to run through a whole litany of the good, the bad, and the indifferent, you know, but when he's prepared and when he's he got his material, he can be a pretty solid MC, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So you, but the thing is, with Mac Myron, mm -hmm. he's a consummate professional. He's always going to be prepared. Right. If he's doing a two-on-two -two with Clean, just know they're going to be straight. They because be both clean. of them are going to be in their pockets and in their bags. Mac Myron, he's a phenomenal puncher. And when you're teaming him up with Clean, who has one of Clean's best attributes is delivery and yes. cadence. Yes. And the way he's able to deliver. Bitch! Bitch! <laughs> like, he's able to say things like and really get it off. Like, mm -hmm. he, like there were certain things that he said in his battle of Swervo after his first couple points. Like, yeah, bitch, yeah. Mm -hmm. Letting them know, like, that's what type of party this is going to be mm -hmm. in the crowd. And another thing that they did, they snatched the crowd. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Uh, yeah, they were in Maryland. Yeah, and they were in Maryland. <laughs> so, uh, what you, what's up, man? What you think, man? I thought that the performance on both sides was pretty dope. Um, it's one of those things where... I am a big fan of Tay Rock, so therefore that 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 the biasness may be on that side. Like, yeah, I want Tay Rock to do well, but he has a handicap with Swervo. Mm -hmm. I'm not saying I don't like Swervo. It's because of the fact that Swervo's delivery and Tay Rock's delivery are two different styles of delivery. Right. For them to match it the way that they did, mm -hmm. first and second round, it was great. But you could tell, In the third, third they time. definitely let off the gas. Mm -hmm. When it came to clean and it came to Matt. Mm -hmm. Belt to ass, all three. What? It, they were on point. They knew where they was at. They didn't have to mess up. There was no stump. Like, I mean. It was it a slip or blip or even in the way when they started doing the imitations. Mm -hmm. the, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. the pun intended, clean was, was clean. clean. <laughs> like, like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and, and then when they did the impersonation, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I thought it was kind of on point. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it was so good. In fact, even Smack even said, Mm -hmm. <laughs> we just gonna leave it at that, you know what I'm saying? Cause you know we can't throw the clips in here, you know what I'm saying? Hey, just just you watch the battle, pay the eight, and then watch that, watch that battle, and then also watch the clutch and the and the and the Eunice battle. Y'all might need to watch that. I'm, I'm gonna say that again. Y'all might need to watch that clutch and Eunice battle too. too. But Swervo and Tay Rock, they I, they might have got the first. I say if anything, they might have got the. first. First, I think they had to get their feet. Uh, I don't know because they was trying to fight back. They had to fight the crowd. For sure, for sure, clean and Matt got that second, and I definitely gave them the third. The question now is, is it a gentleman's third? I got thirty balls. Oh. Uh, reason being, number one, you're on the road. You're in another person's city. You yep. know what I'm saying? They in the DMV. They battling over there. It's not supposed to be the other way around. Then in the beginning, like, you know what I'm saying, the reactions was crazy to the point where they had to tell a nigga in the crowd, shut the fuck up. Yeah. Like, he's really overreacting. <laughs> and you can see him there. in the back. So, <laughs> you know, with them fighting that, them having flawless rounds, and there were some moments in the first, I believe, that Rock was, like, getting Swervo back on point, like, yeah. with the next word, like, yeah. swerve on him, swerve yeah. on him, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Like, mm -hmm. when you're doing two-on-twos, 
I watch for stuff like that. Like the other person had to give you the next word, like, mm -hmm. yo, 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 yeah. bad decision. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And he's got a bad decision, mm -hmm. grab the mitt, and your mm -hmm. ass is missing. And you know what I'm saying? I want it to be I've seen clean, clean all up. the way through. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? And I gotta give credit where credit is due. I thought clean, I know clean and Mac perform well together. I've seen him in two on twos, I've seen him do things like that before. Mm -hmm. But to bring that kind of performance, have it translate on URL and have a win means a lot to me. It means a lot to me too, man. I ain't gonna hold you. I mean, they, they, the way that they was talking, Nick, they ain't getting enough plates. I think mm -hmm. they earned another plate. At least, Ma at least Mac Meyer earned another plate. But see, <laughs> the thing is, I don't want them to get caught in the group syndrome as to where they better together right. than they are apart. That's you know what I'm saying? saying. Yeah. Because honestly, them two together have a better performance than well, not clean because clean's got some legendary joints back in the day. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, but re in recent memory. This is the best performance by the two of them together in recent memory. Yes. So, yeah. clean win. I mean, I, when I looked on the little app, I mean, the app record of rounds and all that don't really count. It don't matter, mm. you know what I'm saying? But they have them winning every round on there, too. Okay. Well, yeah, they did. Well, I mean, well, you know, they be biased. So they, uh, well, that's crazy, because you it's think, supposed to be biased all the way. Yeah. <laughs> see what I'm saying? Yeah, I ain't see mad what at I'm that. saying? I ain't mad at that, man. See what I'm saying? Um, so, yeah, like I said, uh, we, the year's starting to open up, you know, there may be some more events going on. Yeah, you know, I seen Arsenal release, B Magic's gonna be on his YouTube mm. car. He releasing a lot of names, you know what I'm saying? So we gotta see exactly where that goes. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I wanna see where that goes. I wanna see how they gonna match them up because there's some names on there that I didn't think they was gonna they would battle, but I mean I'm with it. It's not you dub if they don't bring my boy Rad B back, man. Hey. Like I see my nigga Rad B, man. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. It's not, it, it ain't there. It, it ain't if it ain't Rad B, it don't count, bro. Like, I gotta see him. <laughs> Come on, man. You gotta bring back the, the true, not the new aura, bring back the true aura. <laughs> I, think, I think I think they need to bring back the original champion oh, okay. of, of UW. Ooh. Real sick. Oh, that'd be crazy. He's gotta have that. You would think he's gotta have that. Right? I mean, I mean, it's yeah, not a, well, we it's it's not a jersey, have, but it's, I mean, I mean. He's gotta have that. I mean. I mean. <laughs> yeah, yeah it's I would be. like to see Rule 6 somewhere too, man. Mm. Look, man, yeah. We'll see. But other than that, man, you already know what it is, man. Salute to every single one of y'all. Don't get a gun involved. Gang, gang. Bye.